occasionally, one of the things I'm going to be doing on my channel is I'm going to be reviewing some products, things related directly to being an artist, generally things directly related to painting, but we'll see how they go. Uh, this is one such product, Stay Wet Premier Palette, Premier Stay Wet, I'm not really sure why, oh, it's just three different languages, I, I imagine. But uh, ideal for projects that require maximum palette surface. No more wasted paint. Masterson's patented process keeps acrylics and other water-based paints moist on the open palette for hours. Once the lid is closed, the paints will stay in workable condition for days, even weeks. A wet sponge and special permeable palette paper provide the paint with a constant source of moisture. Paints will not dry out. The airtight container can be used to store oil paints also. Each palette contains five sheets of Stay Wet acrylic palette paper, cellulose sponge, palette tray and lid, complete instructions for preparation and use. This is by Masterson Art Products Incorporated. I purchased this at Blick Art Supplies, which I'm sure many artists are going to be familiar with and let's uh, let's open it up see what we've got inside I never used one of these before but I've heard good things I know I should be cutting away right for safety oh well live dangerously right Let's see here. This is just that, nothing on the back. So, really of no importance. Uh, some kind of sheet oh, here, probably in big or letters. Or other Let's open it up. Mm, it's a very good seal. Could probably keep food in here if I wanted, but that would be weird. Very expensive container for food that's probably not really food safe. Okay, um, Masterson Stay Wet Palette, basic directions for use. I'm not going to read all of it. So it sounds like I should be able to um, reuse the paper a few times and not just throw it out every time I want to start, start painting again. That's good, that's good. Here's the paper and the sponge. Just a plastic empty tray inside. So the idea is I moisten this sponge, place it there. It's kind of slightly big for its use. That's interesting. And I take one of these sheets of paper. Very thick and sturdy feeling paper. And uh, place it on top. And then use this as my palette. Hopefully you can see this, but it doesn't seem to quite line up correctly. I find that a little strange, but according to the directions, uh, moistening this, is it's going to change its shape enough that it's going to fit properly in its con container. Final thoughts on the Masterson Stay Wet palette. I think if you use acrylic paint for just about anything, you're going to really find this useful. It's going to work well for small projects that you can even store inside of this. Say you're working on something like you're painting rocks or miniatures and you got to drop what you're doing, you can just put it inside, put the, the lid on top. Go run off, do what you need to take care of, and come back to it. And everything's going to be fine. Your paints are still going to be wet. 
and whatever that small item is is going to be protected under that cover. Uh, some other interesting things about this is I would say this is very much preferable to any kind of homemade solution that I've heard of. Because for one thing, this sponge is purpose made for this item. This basically is going to be very durable. You're going to be able to put it through the, a, a, a washing machine. The paper itself, I've never run across paper like this before, but this paper it doesn't seem like much. It's been washed about five or six times and it's not showing any signs of wear. The only way you can tell that it's been used is there's some light staining in different spots from the darker colors. In fact, today, this paint's been sitting here for over an hour and it is still completely wet. Uh, I highly recommend it and I think you're really gonna find this a useful tool. If you do anything with acrylic paint, there's probably gonna be use for this in your tools. It works well for illustration, fine art, crafting, rock painting, miniature painting, it's gonna be great. It's large enough, you're even gonna be able to fit some of your projects inside of this thing if you really need to. Like for example, you got some rocks that you're working on, you can just slip a couple inside, close this thing up, you, you can go do what you have to do real quick and come back to it. Now, what I wanna know is what did you think of this product review? And do you have any questions regarding the Stay Wet palette? Did I not fully cover it? Is there something that you feel needs to be addressed about the subject? I wanna know, so just put it in your comments below and I will get right back to you. Thank you.